because this is buildings over bags and we're absolutely sharing the wealth. <laughs> Don't think I'm crazy. But literally, the rest of the conference is going to be just like this. Me and you and some of our investor friends talking and sharing no frills just all real for those of you that don't know me my name is yolanda kills walker and i am the founder of her wealth her way right buildings over bags has been something that i have been dreaming of since last year i was online reading this black enterprise article and it said something of the effect uh black women you know net worth five dollars and I was like, oh, you're a whole lie because we're popping on Instagram. You know, everybody has a bag. So I know, you know, Chanel definitely retains this value. I know we, you know, at least worth a good three to five thousand. But that was lies. <laughs> and the more I studied, the angrier I got because we have an insane buying power. 1.2 trillion actually more than 1.2 trillion we spend an insane amount of money on things that depreciate that are not real assets and so for me i'm thinking what is it that i can do to help shift the culture because the article is definitely talking about me you know as an african-american woman as someone who is raising african-american children african-american women little women as someone who has a black mother black aunts nieces um cousins and those that are raising kids as you know i look at my sorority sisters as i look at employees and the people around me and partners what is it that i can do to help shift the culture her Wealth, Her Way was born and Buildings Over Bags was born. And, you know, let's just be real. We love things, right? A lot of people don't assume you even have wealth if you don't look like money. So we're going to get this out of the way right now because as investors, we don't necessarily care about looking like money. We just care about the money. So for those of you that need to see you know a bag in order to believe that people have real wealth let let's just get it out of the way now okay okay um here's a nice celine bag yep had it beautiful okay let's see here uh balenciaga had this for a couple years very nice okay yep good good okay all right um let's see um of question <sighs> okay so for those of you that needed that there you go right let me show y'all my favorite bag my favorite bag secures the bag right my real estate bag is absolutely by and far my favorite bag i love real estate i love real estate investing um took me a long time to get in i tiptoed stuck my baby toe in stuck my big toe in stuck my foot in and then dive all the way in and we'll get into what that looked like for me we'll get into what that looked like for other investors but i say all of that to say it's a mind shift it's a mind shift the people that are on this conference are not about airs look i wore my real hair for y'all <sighs> my real lashes i don't have look look my real nails like it is what it is we're keeping it all the way real you're not gonna get a lot of fluff you're not gonna get a lot of makeup and you know designer clothes and all of that because we're talking buildings over bags it's not about the frills it's not about you know what we look like it's all about what that bank account is looking like and how to build real wealth and so i want to say that in case you had any predetermined judgments i know that a lot of you are familiar with my other brand the business babes you get a lot of that over there right business babes yeah we like to dress up and do all that thing but on this side we're wearing the hard hats the construction boots and hitting the bank like that's what we're doing over this side and so i want to set the expectation because i know that a lot of us have that sex in the city mindset you know carrie bradshaw she's a whole lie when she said oh i like my money right where i can see it in my closet you're a whole lie 
And that's part of the reason why our net worth is the way that it is, because we want to look a certain way and act rich without actually being rich. This conference is for people that actually want to be rich, don't really even care if you think we're rich, not into looking like we're rich because we don't want people asking for our money. You know, different, different mindset, different mindset. And so I just want to introduce you to some amazing investors that have all been where you are. I want to ask that you do a couple of things for me. I want to ask that you, number one, commit to it, no matter what it looks like for you. If you are sitting at home and you're like, I don't have the money, I don't have the credit, I don't have, I don't have, I don't have, I, no, we're going to stop it right there, right? Commit to it. I will be in it. I am a real estate investor. I am. I am a real estate investor. You are actively working towards it. You are actively seeking to invest in real estate. And whatever those barriers are to entry, we're going to help you get over them. Train yourself. Every time an excuse comes up, oh, um, you know, she doesn't have kids. Oh, you know, I'm a whole single mom. I'm a single mom too. Oh, you know, this one has a husband and this one, you know, has a man. This, this is new. This is new. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. I've been a single mom. I've been struggle mode. I've been all of those things. So, you know, let's just cut any excuse that, you know, kind of comes to your mind now. When you feel those things coming up, those excuses coming up, nip them in the bud. I am a real estate investor, right? So I just want to ask that you commit to it. Two, set aside time every single day. Set aside an hour for the next week every single day. If, um, you know, you can do from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. when these drop, do it. If you work a nine to five and you get home and you have to cook and babies and all that other stuff from 8 p.m., to 9 p.m., that is your dedicated time. Nothing comes in between that in that time. Not Game of Thrones, not Housewives of anything, not Love and Hip Hop, nothing. They have their money. They're making great money. We're trying to get some money, right? So let's schedule that time. Put it on your calendar, and nothing comes in between that. No distractions. No distractions. None. Three, share it with somebody. If you have a cousin that you know is like-minded, if you have a friend, um, a sister, uh, just anybody, someone that could be a great partner for you, a great resource for you, someone that you know may be interested in leveling up their life and building wealth, share this conference with them. Share the things that you are learning with them, right? I'll do you one even better. Like We wanna keep you accountable. So every day that you tune in, I want you to post something. It can be in your stories. It can be, you know, on your Facebook page. It can be on your Instagram page. Post every single day at us. You know how people are like, don't at me? No, at me. At her wealth her way. I want to repost it, number one. And then number two, I want to come to your page every single day. Because if I don't see you posting, hey, boo, we ain't see you today. I need to see you every day for the next seven days. Like, like that's what we're doing. We're keeping each other accountable because we want to ensure that you're succeeding. Every single person that's on this conference like is excited about sharing and excited about shifting the culture because we need more people that look like us in this space. It's not easy. It's absolutely not easy. Um, and so we know how it feels to be a woman and to be intimidated by this and all of that. Guess what? The more of us that there are in this space, the better, the easier it makes it. For the next woman to come along the easier it makes it for us to partner for us to leverage one another for us to get financing for us to share resources all of that so share it absolutely share it with the next person and honestly y'all can come up together um share it with your audience because you honestly need to be intentional about building wealth be intentional about it yes i am learning about real estate this is important to me Hashtag buildings over bags at her wealth her way because we want to come to your page every single day. Be like, hey, boo boo. Oh, okay. Yeah, you on, you on the eight o'clock shift, 8 p.m. Got you. Um, these videos will expire every single day at 9 a.m. So make sure that you watch between 9 a.m. to 9 a.m. that next day. And we're doing it like that because we don't want it to just sit in your email box. That's not how this goes. This is active learning. So we need you to be active every single day 
for the next week. And lastly, connect with the speakers. If someone shares their information with you um, via their website, via their social media links, follow them, right? Follow them because you want that motivation in your feed every single day. You want to see how these people's rehabs are coming along. You want to see what tips they're, you know, giving every single day. You want to see when they have classes coming up. You, you know, need to form relationships with mentors and with the people that are doing the things that you want to do. So that way it's a whole lot easier for you. The biggest growth hack is to legit take somebody's path to success and copy that thing. Like, that's it. That's it. I did a million dollars in nine months, right, of real estate. But copying somebody's blueprint that's it oh you would made these moves to be successful i'm going to make these same moves to be successful right and i'm going to share that with you gotta tune in though to get it lastly have fun have fun i know it seems like a big giant mountain to climb but guess what big thighs save lives honey that's why we got them it's time to get it popping Thick thighs save lives. So if you feel like this is a big mountain to climb, lace up your shoes and let's go. Um, and I will tell you, it's not as intimidating as you think it is. If I can do it, all things not handy, um, all things girly, um, all things like gonna get it done though. If I can do it, you can absolutely do it. So this is not to be intimidating for you. This is not to, you know, feel like it's enough. Like it's just, it's time to go. It's absolutely time to go. Again, all of us, we are all rooting for you. Tyra Banks on them, we are all rooting for you. All of the investors that are on this conference, follow them. Absolutely, they are all rooting for you. Tell them, hey, I'm a part of this conference. I saw you, um, you know, I love to connect with you. They are all rooting for you. Absolutely. Um, and we are all Team Iyanla on some, not on my watch. It's time for all of us to get this money. We want more people in this space that look like us, that partner with us, that make it. Because, and I didn't give these statistics. Let me just run it back real quick. While we're doing zero to five dollars of net wealth for those of us that are in that 20 to 39 realm, um, our counterparts are between 3,400 and 75. Uh, hundred for those of us African American women that have degrees and that are over 60 60 six zero the net worth is twelve thousand dollars can you imagine going to heaven you know hopefully not at 60 praise them um but just telling God you know hey God and him saying you know hey I gave you all of these things all of this access you know you had 60 years of your life to do great things and you know kind of change the trajectory of your family and um you know do some things and you come to him with with nothing right with very little um that's not a good feeling to have and i'm not saying that in a materialistic way i'm not saying that in a financial way i'm saying that in um a sowing and reaping way right money brings access it brings freedom um, and it honestly brings a lot of options. It's not just about having money to spend on things, but it's access, it's freedom, and it's options. And those are things that you want to afford yourself. Those are things that you absolutely want and need to afford your children and things that you know you should have. So with that being said, to go back to these statistics, I'm gonna get off my soapbox. Um, for us, that number was $12,000. For our counterparts, it was $384,000. And i tell you how they did it. Real estate. Real estate, real estate, real estate. Most people are millionaires in this country for, you know, the, the number one reason is because they invest in real estate. And so, again, we're going to show you how. I hope that you all enjoy this next session and the session that comes after that. Just make sure that you tune in every single day. Again, we want to keep you honest. Hashtag buildings over bags at her wealth, her way and post it. 
And when you see other people posting it, you follow those people, you connect with those people. Those people, you know, honestly are going to keep you invested, keep you grounded, keep you accountable. And hopefully, you know, you all can partner and support each other in the future. This is a whole movement. The marathon absolutely continues. This is not a sprint. This is slow money. This ain't new money. There's a whole lot. Oh, wait. No, I was about to quote Migos. <laughs> this ain't old money. It's new money. And this new money is going to be slow money and long lasting money. So again, my name is Yolanda. Any questions, email me info at herwealthherway.com. We're absolutely going to get into credit. We're going to get into financing. We're going to get into rehabbing. We're going to get into, you know, the easiest ways that you all can invest. I'll share my story in terms of how I got started. Um, and it wasn't pretty. <laughs> and again, I hope that you all enjoy this. I hope that you have fun and let's get it. <laughs>